It's a debate that's putting students in limbo just weeks before the first day of school. The push for virtual learning to start the school year in Hillsborough County continues. ABC Action News reporter Vanessa Ariza has more on what we could see happen within the coming days. Hillsborough County Superintendent Addison Davis met with state education leaders in Tallahassee yesterday advocating for virtual learning for the first few weeks of school. This comes as we're learning the district could stand to lose $23 million in state funding if it goes against the state order and doesn't reopen schools at the end of the month. That's according to school board member Cindy Stewart. It certainly would impact teachers. It certainly would impact our facilities and the, you know, what we are doing in our facilities. A special meeting is scheduled for tomorrow to discuss the next steps for the district. The state is asking district leaders to submit an amended reopening plan by Friday. As parents, students and teachers wait in limbo as far as what is going to happen next, there's one school counselor who is going out of her way to listen to the kids even before classes start. We'll share her story with you and what she's doing coming up within the next 30 minutes. In Tampa, Vanessa Ariza, ABC Action News.